Peter Shanae here for Sound and Dirty on VIP TV. Now we're inside the Dolphins bubble and tonight will be their first evening training camp. So who's ready for some football? We've got Cameron Wake here with the Dolphins. How was practice today, Cameron? Um, practice was a lot of fun. You know, we're starting to wind down this, uh, this game week. The guys are anxious. We've been you know, hitting each other for <laughs> it feels like a week and a half now. It's time to hit another player. It's all of us coming together on one sideline and, uh, you know, work at this thing collectively. Best and worst thing about training camp? Um, worst. There's no worst. It's football. you got to love it every minute. It's the best thing, um, probably getting back on the field with the fellas. You know, it's, it's been a long off season. you know, being everybody going back home in different places. But coming together, getting the pads on, and, and getting after it is something that I definitely enjoy. Talk about your adjustment from 3-4 to 4-3. A lot of people talk about it, but for me, you know, doing what I did last year, you know, 70, 60% of the time I was, you know, had my hand in the dirt, you know, I was coming off the edge. So the same kind of things I'm, I'm doing now. So it's not that much different. You know, I feel like a guy, my skill set, you know, I can kind of fit in either role and uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Now you tackled Tebow twice last year with Denver. Are you excited to maybe do that again this year? <laughs> if the quarterback has a ball, I'm excited to tackle him. It doesn't matter what his name on the back of his jersey is, Tebow, Brady, Sanchez, I mean, Smith, it, it doesn't matter. How was practice today? Uh, you know, it was pretty good. You know, the pace and tempo isn't full speed, but, you know, you get the mental reps, and that's all you can take. You know, that's all you can do out there and just, you know, work through your craft and, you know, get the plays down. High school football is actually gaining a lot of visibility yeah. right now. What can you tell us about what you learned in high school football that translates today as a man in the pros? Basically hard work and dedication. Uh, in high school, you know, being able to play all those sports, you have to definitely be dedicated to one at a time, you know, and uh, be able to get through your schoolwork and whatnot. So it just showed, it, it taught me persistence and, uh, and patience and dedication. Now you're a broadcast journalism major, right? Yeah, I mean, what could I say? I'm trying to get on TV. You gonna take my job from me? Not your job, but somebody <laughs> else's. Somebody else's job will be going. Yeah. You'll be my co-host. <laughs> Best and worst thing about training camp. Best and worst thing about training camp. The worst thing to me is waking up, and the best thing is coming in here and going to work. Uh, I, I, I wouldn't trade it for the world. I love my teammates, coaches, everybody. So it's just fun, man. You come out here and have fun and get through the day, and, you know, hopefully you still be here at the end of the, uh, you know, roster cuts and be able to do it for another year. What can your fans expect from you this season? A lot of speed, a lot of excitement, a lot of big plays. Uh, in the special teams game, on the offense, just wherever I'm needed, I'm going to put in work, and I got y'all. It's more than more of the Miami Dolphins. You're watching First Down and Dirty on VIP television. I'll let me. You got the night camp tonight. What can we expect? Go out there and play hard like we've been doing. Everybody's perform. Everybody's trying to get better and push each other. So we're really excited about playing uh, this afternoon. It's going to be a fun practice, hard but fun. Now let's talk about the best and the worst thing about training camp. The best part is you're getting better, you know, getting ready to play each other. You get tired of hitting each other, but, you know, for the most part, it's fun. You play against your teammates and build a bond, you know, work together. Talk about how high school football has helped you transition as a man in the pro. Discipline, you know, my coach stayed on me, you know, because I was one of the better people in high school. And, you know, same thing in NFL and uh, college, you know, they stay on you, push you hard, so kind of transition over. What can fans expect from you this season, Randy? Expect me to go out there and play hard, do the best I can to help this team win. You're watching the IPTV. Go, go Fins! Go, go Dolphins! Dolphins.